It's a really special feeling, especially considering that KU has had a team and we have not had anything to compete with them in that. And so it feels cool to represent Mizzou in a different way that I haven't been able to before. He was like, hey, did you hear there's a club? And I was like, what? No, I didn't know that. And then I was like, give me some details. And he's like, Texas guy named Jared. My name is Jared Bravent, and I've been playing disc golf for about two or three years. Um, it just really was me out playing, and I would find anyone that looked like they were college kids, and I would be like, hey, you guys in college at Mizzou? And if they said yes, I would just immediately ask, hey, do you want to be on a team? Because I just cut to the chase. It worked pretty well. Everyone was stunned after I asked them that. So it's happened pretty quick, but like, no, we haven't actually like really hung out a lot. And you just kind of start playing, so some people just play recreationally, and then there's people like Eric and I who just get really competitive at it. Expectations going into Saturday. So one of us obviously is going to walk away with it, but I'm pretty confident in our team. Got a point. As long as you got a game plan, I'm fine with it, I guess. So. I'm going across the creek 10 times out of 10. Has it been very many good drives? Sometimes, yeah. All right, Eric Downey. I like that because Nathan. I was second to last card, so I got to see my whole team go through except for the last guy. It was cool getting to see them all tee off, get their names read off, just see like an actual tournament format. I won't watch you guys. <laughs> I'll be watching. A little nerve-wracking, actually, because, you know, it's like, if they're, if, I mean, it's their first shot of a tournament for some of them, like, ever. Oh, no. Back. Back. After the first round, the singles, we were down by six strokes total. We wanted to get first, because that's how you, in order to qualify for the, the national championship, you have to get first in, the, in this tournament. Ooh, getting clean. Oh, get it. Nice up. We tried to make up six strokes, but it was, that's a lot to make up with 18 holes. It's, it's just mostly letting them know, like, hey, it's part of disc golf. Like, we know, like, we, it's a tough loss, but, I mean, that's how it goes. So the next opportunity we're going to have is going to be in March, early March, in Jonesboro, Arkansas. I would say Arkansas is probably our last chance. I mean, realistically, we had like two months to get to know each other, get to play, get to know everyone's strengths. So it's like going into it, we know. I mean, we can smooth out a lot of the rough edges. I'm going to be doing this regardless, and I'm all for the team and everything. So whenever spring comes around, I think we'll be like twice as competitive as a team. There's been people who've tried to form this before and it just hasn't solidified. So I'd hate to see this end up in the same result because I think we've already taken it farther than anybody else has really. Looking forward, we are pretty confident we're going to start an institution here. Um, with everything, I've got a ton of community support. They're all behind it. They'll, they said they'll keep supporting us even after I'm gone. We're looking forward, all of our guys have said, hey, we want to do this for the off season. Hey, we want to do this for next year. As a team, yeah, we're, we're here to stay.